<laughs> we have got one final cruise, though, and I can't wait for Keith to talk us through this one. It's with Celebrity Five Star Luxury, Modern Luxury, on board the Celebrity Infinity. And it truly is a cruise of a lifetime, this one. But let's take you on board, because Celebrity offer the most amazing service and the most beautiful ships that have won so many awards. So here's a little taster. Yeah, now of course, this is Celebrity Infinity, uh, one of many of these gorgeous five-star ships. It's an American cruise company, which are all about class and sophistication, but in a laid-back and stylish manner. They're known for their cuisine. I know, I know, we're, you know we're both a big fan of the, uh, the wonderful choice that Celebrity offer, and also the quality, Sean. I'm, I'm sat here feeling absolutely starving because I've hardly eaten today. I'm just I'm remembering all the great food I have absolutely. on board. Absolutely. You know, you've got so much from cuisine, where you have the quirky sushi lollipops, you know, all, all the way through, you know, to, to the classic steakhouse. Uh, they even got Ben Fogel recently as a destination expert and he's been advising on yes. different tours people can do you know so maybe you want to go and uh, snorkel with salmon in Norway you know it's really good really good fun quirky they have cooking competitions on board mixology classes dance and language classes um, they also do magical sailway experiences from the bridge they have ice bars on board with juggling waiters um, and a really good selection of different wines for you to enjoy and their aqua class as well which for health lovers that love the spa and love healthy dining you get your own special restaurant to eat in this is the molecular the Martini Bar. Oh, it's incredible, fabulous. incredible selections of cocktails being made, and the eye lounge, Sean. I mean, you know, the, the value you get on the on the on the, the iPads, and if you want to buy yeah. stuff, because it's in US dollars. And actually, and the exchange it, rate. The exchange rate is great at the moment. Exactly. Yeah, it's worth thinking about that. Actually, it really, really is. I mean, they're so good. They even do language classes with Rosetta Stone as well, so you can la learn a language, educate yourself while you're away. Honestly, I I couldn't fault Celebrity when I cruised them early on this year, and. Um, this really is an amazing itinerary as well. Going to talk us through then, Keith? I am, yeah. I just want to say very quickly, one of the restaurants on board is going for its first Michelin star, the USS United States. Really? Incredible, yeah. Which well, is, you know, again, first. That does, doesn't, doesn't it? it? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so, yeah, look at this. This is going to be a chance, first of all, to go through to Vancouver. And this is ranked in what the world's top five cities for quality of life. It gives you an idea. Um, and you've got so much to do here. You've got wonderful Stanley Park. You can go and taste oysters in Granville Island Market, which is really known. Uh, of course, originally known as Gas Town. It was called Gas Town for a, for a reason, because uh, Gassy Jack started the whole place. Uh, I won't tell you why it was called Gassy Jack. The best thing to do, <laughs> uh, the glass elevator, 430 foot up. Uh, there's a wonderful lookout at the top there, 360 degree views of the city and the mountains and you've a cruise ship below. You've also got the aquarium with over 70,000 creatures to enjoy including whales and uh, white dolphins, otters and harbour seals and sea lions. It's an incredible place and the famous Grouse mountain ride is something you have to do. It takes you up nearly 4,000 foot into the mountains. Really? Yeah, really great. Okay, so then we're getting on board the ship after you've got a night there. And uh, you've got seven nights cruising on board the Infinity, and you're going to go straight out into Alaska. Inside Passage is the first place, uh, and this is great, a labyrinth of fjords and bays where whales and sea lions find their refuge during the summer months. Um, then we're going to the icy straight point, and this is where you're going to see uh, the incredible, well, this is where the Tinjit people, they've called it home for thousands of years, Sean. And you're going to get a chance to see eagles and brown bears in the natural habitat and humpback whales. Um, you can go well watching, you can do so much, and you can meet some of the Tinjit people as well. Um, the Hubbard Glacier is next, it's known as the, the Galloping Glacier, uh, and this is... Uh, Alaska at its very, very best. Um, it's 76 miles long and it plunges nearly 1,200 uh, feet uh, into the bay. And from here, you, you'll see large bits of ice just falling off and crashing down. And the sound that it makes and the sight is just absolutely magical. Because so, uh, this is so on my wish list, you know. I, I, it's, it's incredible, Sean. It really, really is. I mean, some of these, some of these bits of icebergs that it expels are 10 stories high. I mean, they're just falling in front of you into the water and you've got all the wildlife surrounding you. It's a magical place. Just look at the images you're seeing now. Um, then you're going to go across to your first port of call after all that sailing, you know, um, uh, Juneau, Alaska. It's the capital city. And you just see lots of imagery here of some of the beautiful things you're going to see when you're out in Alaska. Give you an idea. From here you can see the Mendenhall Glacier. Uh, it's part of the Juneau Ice Field. Uh, and it's just absolutely incredible again. You can actually sail up on a gondola, nearly 2,000 foot in the air, to see everything from the air. Um, then you're going to get to Katachua in Alaska, and this place literally translates as spreading wings of a thundering eagle, and it's a bird's paradise. Um, you just saw the bear playing there, you've seen the elk, you've seen the buffalo. It, this is a salmon, this is a salmon lovers, this is a, 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 it's a, a nature lovers paradise, it really, really is. I was going to say that because Katachua is the salmon capital of the world. Oh, okay. That's why. And you can kayak through and see them leaping out of the water. 
Um, then again, you get back through the inside passage before you get back into Vancouver and you get off to enjoy another night's stay in Vancouver. So if you didn't have enough of it the first time, there's even more. You're seeing some of the birds that you can see. You know, oh. it's, it's absolutely incredible. You just won't want to close your eyes. Do you know, I, I love presenting this show because, you, you know, it's so exciting to see these, these destinations. And, you know, and to think, yeah, one day I hope I'll book it. Hopefully tonight you will be booking this and uh, enjoying this uh, January next year or June next year, I should say. But it hasn't finished yet. Kate, it hasn't because has we're back now. We're back in Vancouver and uh, we've got off and then we're literally going to board the Rocky Mountaineer and this is incredible you're going to take a trip through the Rockies the heart of the Rockies this this Rocky Mountaineer train is the best way to travel through the Rockies it's won eight world travel awards uh, and it's incredible you literally sit with these these trains that are surrounded by windows and as you're traveling through the heart of the Rockies you're going to see everything from eagles again black bears lumberings in the canyon below you're getting an idea you see the windows on the top they're all the windows that you can just look out of over these massive bridges and you're you're heading into the Rockies, you know, with this wonderful balance between nature uh, and what man has created. Um, and then you're going to head, of course, you get a night uh, to, to, to enjoy um, in, a, in a hotel, and then you're heading out all the way through to Banff, where you eventually get off and enjoy the splendours of Banff. And the great thing is, Keith, this is all arranged and organised for us, isn't it? It is, yeah. I mean, I mean you stay in Kamloops the first night, then you get back on the Rocky Mountaineers, you head through to Banff, which is known as the capital of the Rockies, Sean. Um, and this really is, as I say, back to nature. It's, you're surrounded by these incredible vistas. Wherever, wherever you look, it's nature, it's wildlife, it's mountains, these beautiful, beautiful trees that just soar into the air. Uh, and this is one of the best ways to enjoy it. And the dates that we've got throughout June, July and August, great dates for this across Cape. Yeah, absolutely really good, really good for the weather for you to enjoy. There's loads of upgrades available, silver and gold leaf available, which will give you better views and a better culinary experience on board the train. Um, and you can even upgrade the, to the deluxe rail experience, and that will give you a full tour of Banff when you arrive, including the Banff gondola, a helicopter ride over the Rockies, uh, and a motor coach tour from Banff up to Calgary. It's incredible. So there's loads of different things you can get in touch when you ring up. Uh, and don't forget, you know, if you've just got a few queries, a few questions, we have got very experienced cruise consultants. They're ready to take your call just to help you, you know, decide what's right for you tonight. And it is a free phone number as well. 0800 840 1088. What time's the call centre open to, Keith? 10 o'clock tonight. 10 o'clock tonight, sure. tonight yeah. lovely. And first thing tomorrow. This is the ship that you're going to be on board, by the way. The Infinity. Yeah, beautiful ship, you know. And oh, again, stunning. And again, with, you know, you're looking at photos there of Blue, which is the, the healthy eating restaurant. There's so much variety, such good service. Uh, and they have a ratio of, of, of one crew member to every two passengers. So very high service levels. And I think when you, when you are doing a, a trip of a lifetime such as this, you want to make sure that you, know, you are getting the very best, and you will do with Celebrity. Five-star modern luxury. Um, now, if you do go, we've got some great prices on the Ocean View. You'll get, actually, a free classics drinks package. So if you do book an Ocean View, you'll get the drinks package. Really worth doing that. Or you return flights. We can provide flights from most UK airports. And you've got those uh, extra nights, of course, in Vancouver and Banff. Incredible value. Come loops, yeah. It really is. For the Rockies, for all of that, for Alaska. Uh, and if you'd say, do go for the Ocean View, and we've got those for, you know, only a couple of hundred pounds more, you'll get that drinks package. And their classics drinks package does include so much. So when you actually look at the difference there... Only a few hundred pounds, and yet you'll get the classic drinks package. So it's definitely worth doing that. Absolutely, yeah. You'll be saving. You'll, you'll be saving money. And then excursion-wise, these really are outstanding value through Planet Cruise. You can save up to sixty percent of what you'd pay on board.